Entering food orders into your POS software should be as simple and easy as can be. Your servers should know their POS software like the back of their hand. So today, we're going to show you how easy it is to use our Total Restaurant POS software. Here's what we're going to go over today. How to enter in orders, how to check out, how to add coupons, how to add customers, how to set up customer loyalty points, even how to organize your floor plan. Now let's jump in and get started. Once you open the Total Restaurant POS software, you'll be given the option to enter in your password. This will drop you straight into your seating chart. At the login screen, you'll see a layout of your business. Now on the seating chart page, simply clicking on a table will open up your menu. At the top, you can jump between categories filled with individual items. To select an item, simply click on it. Here we'll select 12 wings. Maybe another person wants 6 wings. Now how about a drink with that? Dessert? Yes please. How about a pie? Nope. Let's take the pie off by clicking on the item and hitting the X button. Instead, let's add pudding. Once you're finished inputting the order, press pay to view payment options. Your customer may pay with either cash, check, credit cards, debit cards, gift cards, coupons, and other third-party payment services. Coming back to the order screen, you have some more options to look at before checking out the customer. Click on tools to see options like purchase or reload gift cards and store cards. Here you can also open up your cash drawer by hitting the button. You can even print the ticket here as well. Select bulk to do things like send rush orders or even a memo to the kitchen. Select void to void the ticket. Select split to split the check between guests. If you'd like to edit individual items, select Open Item button. Here you can do things like set a price, send orders to a specific kitchen, and add modifiers. Select Discount to add coupons to the order. Select Change Customer to add new customer information into the system. This is for customer loyalty reasons or to even view past orders. Here you can also add a new ticket for new orders. When you're all finished on the menu screen, hit close and return to the seating chart. Select tools again, then edit map to get started making your floor plan. Organize your floor to look just like your restaurant. On this page, you can set your entire front end and back end. To begin, select a table. Select X and Y orientation to make the tables wider or taller. Select a guest max count. Even select the type of table. Then place tables wherever you want them. When you're finished, hit save and close. Back on the main screen on the right hand side, you can select tickets to view and edit open tickets for each customer. You can see a tab to print a ticket or to split print tickets. Under tools, you may adjust tips. You may order, reload gift cards, check balance. This is something you can do with our store card as well. At the end of your session, to exit back to the main login page, hit the out button at the top right corner. Don't forget, you have 60 seconds of inactivity before the dashboard will automatically return to the main login screen. As always, we're here to help. You can always reach us by phone at 704-523-6244 or online at www.totalmerchantsupply.com.